So spring has finally sprung and it's time to hook up the propane for the fridge and the stove on the island. This is what it kind of looks like. This tank was in the ice house protection of the winter. And as you can see, there's some tin foil wrapped around the ends of the connectors to go into the propane tanks. That's for protection from the winter as well as the spiders that want to build webs in there. So we'll take those off before we put them in. There's the wrench to tighten everything up. And this is the most important thing is the supply switch. As you can see it says turn handle before disconnecting empty cylinder. And it's pointing to the supply. Right now we're not going to have anything here. We're going to put it here, just this 20 pound tank. And that's going to be our supply. And when this little light, it's already showing red, or a light form of red, I won't say pink, but it's kind of light because of the years, it says replace empty cylinder when red shows. So again, you'd come over here, and it would mean that this one is empty, I guess, since this is the supply. And before you undo it, you'd push this over. So the supply would be coming off this other tank. And you might notice that we only have a couple of bricks there and lots of bricks there. That's because this is using a 20 pound tank and I'm gonna use the 40 pound tanks up until they come, until they're done. When they're done, take that cinder block, cement block, put it over there, build it up a little bit and you'll start using two 20 pounders because the 40 pounders will be out of date to refill. So what we're going to do is just like any connection, we are going to put, take this tin foil off and then insert this into here and turn counterclockwise, the opposite remember, to hook up the propane. Since this is brass, which is a soft metal, we don't want to over tighten it with this wrench. We just want to tighten it snug and then do the bubble test, which is hopefully another video I showed you already. Some soapy water, put it on there, turn on the gas and make sure that no bubbles are coming out. That means there's no leakage. Okay, so pretty basic, but it makes the refrigerator make ice and the stove make fire so that we can enjoy this beautiful piece of heaven known as the island. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.